welcome this is behind the helmet the only show in the entire planet that gets to feature the person behind the helmet such great personalities we get to interact with every single day and today is no different this guy is about to get beaten by a girl is he wow. ready we're about to get into game time before you meet our guest this is game time i'm behind the helmet my name is kerry kagiri So the rules of the game are simple. In front of you there is a straw, pieces of paper and a tumbler. Your task is to pick as many papers as possible using the straw, then drop the paper inside the tumbler within 20 seconds. Counting will be done as the competition continues. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. Starting in 3, 2, 1, go. Time's up. <laughs> hey! <laughs> let's count. Let's count. Turn it over, I guess. Turn it, I guess. Where's that for good, yo? Oui. Did I? A good hour. Turn it, turn it. Count, count, what up? Count, what up? To count, what up? Count, to count, what up? A good hour. Do you know how? How many times people come to my show to win me? Come here. To count, let's count, let's count, let's count, guys. Let's count. Let's count, let's count, let's count. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve me, mob. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, actually. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Should we continue about what? Thirteen, fourteen, fifty, sixteen, seventeen. 18 19 20 22 23 24 times the winning and the winner is Kerry You saw the game you saw the champion great sportsmanship hey, At least you're not a bitter loser True true Which was the biggest challenge for your game Eh kwanza the part ile kikombe ilianguka mzee. Oh yes, wow. that, okay, yeah, that kind of set you back. <laughs> But you see again violence is not the answer. I mean I was just sure. gentle. I just want to tell everyone if you're playing this game, I want to advise you <laughs> just like relax number one, to be a champion mm-hmm. anyway, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> ah, iko easy. Mule in the building. Karibu right. sana. Thank you, thank you mzee. Man, you know Nikifikiria one of the nicest people I've met in the riding journey Muko Fikiria. Cuz mm-hmm. you're so nice like you're just genuinely loving, compassionate. Uh you always like just bring a good vibe around the room. So thank you for being a part of my family. Ni god manze. Ni god. I love it. <laughs> so introduce yourself to our audience. We're asking you to bullet or collect. Tell us about that. Yeah. Anyways, my name is Bullet Anthony Masharia. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh number one, I'm a racer, a biker. and a cyclist. Hey. Yeah. So stroke DJ. Al- so anything with two wheels, that a DJ iko na hiyo two wheels. Iko na two not wheels by the way. Eh, iko na deck A na deck B. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so anything that comes in two, maybe twins also. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> But let's not like go there. Let's not go there. <laughs> yeah. But yes, conversation with Bullet himself. Tell us about your racing journey. Before even you tell us about the first time you got on a bike. Mm-hmm. I just want to label this show as Don't Try This At Home. That's the title of our conversation. Mm-hmm. Racing. Ulinge racing wapi aje? 
Uh, so the first time nearly happened to kwenda kucheki race. Uh, ilikuwa ko actually race ya kwanza ya Banesta. E Banesta ka chapa kwa kona flani pale down I think kona four akaenda down na kanunua shamba and I'm like wow. He never told us about that shamba but it's okay. Eh. <laughs> so akanunua shamba and then uh, one of my close friends anaitwa Pitaka niambia eh hey, na najua utaingia hii. Bullet na jua utaingia hii wow. and Yeah, I started. I said why not? Yeah. Hata miacha nikanunua hiyo shamba. Please. Eh. You're so brave. Yeah. I love it for you. Now to the don't try this at home part. Yeah. How did you start riding bullet? <laughs> Sijui ni sema ama niache. Sema but nisha but get a disclaimer. Let me give you my story. So, I've been cycling from actually kutoka 2014 hapo. Okay. And kutoka nikiwa mtoi niko napenda bikes. So actually leta mzai nilikuwa naambia, "Eh, hey, when I grow up, I'll buy a bike." Actually, know nothing about cars, but I know how to drive. Wow. Uh, so passion ya bike nilianza kitambo, but I was like, "Wait, wh- where will I get this money?" Hey, is it bikes manzi zina do? I don't is it gear. <laughs> Wacha ni bike, bike is fine. Gear ya uja ba ukiuza tu hapa una buy plot kamulu, pap na una nua <laughs> some bags of cement. Continue. Yeah. So the first time that nearly chukua bike, actually niko nimechukua cruiser, cruiser 400. And siku wire siku pata siku ride your bike. In fact, your bike you kufika at home. Had you gone to training school before you bought a bike? No. So how did you buy a bike with no riding? Ah, uh, mimi nilisema acha ni bike kitu manze niende nikijuanga. So the first time hata <laughs> niwapatia sa story. Pale story inaanzia. Yeah. So, uh, the first time nilichukua bike. After io 400 nikaona eh hey, manze ita ni uwa just speed napenda speed jo nikiwa na cycle bado niko naenda take it right uh, so i decided acha eh hey, this 400 will kill me wacha tunienda nitafute a bike ya zero mileage so i told edu edu ni mse wa mta right eh hey, ile bike au mazi itafutie mse okay yani itwa edu the king yes kasema eh hey, itafutie mse wacha nikachukua tu ka flasha pale so nikilienda nikachukua flasha pale captain ili kabebo actually nikakuwa pillion <laughs> nikafikisha home kwa ploti and then i parked the bike for so long Niki, nikaenda nikaenroll kwa ka driving school but now that driving school ilikuwa kwa na mseo alikuwa anafunza alikuwa mseo wa boda eh hey, manzi uh, i guess nilimpata tu nika akaniambia aka eh hey, naitwa mse fulani and from that day si kwa impona tena naenda t session napata ako job ah mimi nikasema acha ndio dimta right karudi mtaa nikatulia siku moja nikaamka saa sita usiku manzi ile usingizi imekataa niko zile manzi ile bike mbona imelala pale hiyo pesa yangu mbona iko kwa eh. paki so mimi nilichukua bike nikatoka ah uh, nikachapa laps kidogo mtaa e, nikakuwa eh hey, iki tuna feel tu ni car bicycle Wacha ni chape chape tu lap. Nikajipata nimeingia thika road. You know I've heard about this night riding mm. Mm, business where people just wake up at 3 a.m. can't go back wow. to bed, put on gear and just walk up. Like mm. when unaniambia. So me design ilijua ku, ku ride nilikuwa naangalia tutorials kwa YouTube. <laughs> eh ini clutch ini brake. Ah, okay, how do you do it? So nikaenda acha nijaribu. Mimi nikatoka saa sita, ninakumbuka hiyo day nilirudi saa kumi. Eh, hey, kurudi manze niko zile manze I was so happy. Wow. Ati nime manage kutoka na bike. Eh, hey, but sasa ile kitu ilikuwa na challenge sana ilikuwa kwa kupanda mlima. I was yeah. like, eh, hey, kushuka, kushuka itakuwa rahisi. Kupanda. Kupanda na fani pande aje. Mm-hmm. Anyways, with time nikakaa mku. Sasa nikaendelea tu tutorials, nikalan. Which and year then, was this? For the people who are watching and they're like, "Hey, um say champions, you have so good admire you on." Yeah. That was I guess 2020, yeah. Wow. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. So four year anniversary ni when na bashi ko wapi? Eh, fourth year anniversary itakuwa in April. Yes. Ah, uh, 
actually itakuwa tu inafaa kwa 29th siku ya birthday yangu yes oh <laughs> happy birthday in advance <laughs> thank you thank you iko yeah. na swali how did your family take uh, ready because of already kumwambia na bye bye na bye bye but kuna msali sema what are you doing uh no okay actually it will happen so nilikuwa natoka hata na bicycle naenda naenda na cheki madhi tunakaa na yeye anamwambia eh manzi juu yagedha wacha nitoke mapema right Ah uh, there was a time nilichapa uh, rider di nyeri with a bicycle yeah. siati juu siku anado but ni kwa tatu kupata that experience wow. ya yeah. itakuwaje mm-hmm. mm. So we're talking two wheels we're talking bikes we're talking cyclists when you're talking to bullet he'll throw in cycle he'll throw in motorcycle he'll throw in his wheels of steel and his, his turn tables right yeah. in there Nataka ngutumie e one moment kutuma shout out kwa cyclists wenye wanaweza kwa na watch uh, he show Yeah. So niko kwa group inaitwa Psychopath. Watu wangu wa Cycle Path. A big up. Uh-huh. RDX na Kasa Cyclist. Uh-huh. Right. That's your gang guy. Yeah, true true. To Wheeler community, what has been the most exciting part about now getting into motorcycles? Cuz hiyo kwa kwa basically kwa na community kwa solid mm-hmm. unachapa mpaka hata over 200 kilometers a day. Yeah. yeah. What? Actually the longest ni mechapa uh, 334 kilometers that was up to Namanga and back on on a bicycle. Sasa tu nyamaze because hata Karura nikichapa ile 8 kilometers na kuanga tu na tafuta bali ni jekele kidogo so mm-hmm. I'm not going to make a comment on that but that's what's up. Tonge juu ya motorbike. Mm-hmm. How far have you gone with your bike? Uh, motorbike uh, we may cover um, let's say most of the parts is uh, east africa but the ile part ile ni wai kabisa ilko ko i took map ya kenya nikaeka chini kajiuliza manzi miss kongi mse octembea but nataka kuja i place vile iko so wow. nilichukua map ya kenya nikai draw hivi ka line katikati uh-huh. Nikasema wacha nianze na this part ya chini. Oh, so way. actually I covered uh, like half of actually not half I covered the whole part. Name just throw names of places ulisikia hapa na hapa mpaka si tuuleza eh hiyo place iko Kenya. Mm. Eh. So kuna ride tulichapa na Banesta na crew wengine wasi walikuwa kwa vibe kabisa. Eh. So tulikwenda Garissa na Manga. Ah Garissa, Mombasa tukizunguka hivyo. Yeah. You know, I feel like I'm water to I feel like I'm water like a bike. I feel like I should just hug my boots because you guys mm-hmm. are doing the most the most the most. Napenda kuuliza hii swali kwa issue because we love to give visibility to riders. Ni kitu gani madereva wanafanya kwa barabara that makes hey. you feel like yo share the road. Yeah. So unapata number one, like mse wa Keja ameamua tu ku turn without even indicating. indicating. Mm-hmm. Na ameingia Unlike ukishafika akisha kuona kwa zile za wewe What's wrong with you? Yeah. Pitia uko juu. Like ni kama you don't have the right of kwa ya kuwa kwa barabara. Yeah. So we're really just not sharing the road yeah, to be honest. True, true. Yeah. Ah kwa bikers. Na hapo mm-hmm. unaweza niambia because you've ridden with newbies, you've ridden with people who are professionals. Yeah. What do we as bikers do that we need to work on? Kwa too honest. Tuchome <laughs> to behave. Mm. Okay, kwa bikers naweza sema kuna wala sio utoka bila gears. Number one ukitoka hata kama unaenda tu hapa kwa duka, right. make sure ume gear up. Right. Yeah, because easy bikes ni deal, but kumbuka si ndio body. Mm. True. That's a fact. Yeah. You know we talk about this all the time at gut, all the gear all, all the, the time. time. Watu wako curious, uja mam cute. You do nini na time yake? Okay, other than exploring Kenya and going <laughs> to East Africa and recycling, uh what do you do? What are your skills and and how can anyone who's watching, you know, become a part of your life? Okay. Ah, uh, nasema first of all, I'm an ex DJ. Okay. Wacha niseme ex because nimekaa kidogo bila ku ku spin. Yeah, bila ku spin. Uh-huh. Corona happened. Yeah. Afu nikasema acha ni nitulie tu kiasi. Yeah. So professionally I do networking. Okay. Uh, I'm in the industry of telecommunications. Uh-huh. Umeona zile ma internet towers zile mnapatanga kwa manyumba juu wow. kubwa. Uh-huh. So I maintain them. 
most of them. Hi, guys, I have a friend who's <laughs> who's into networking, please. Muwacha kudiagalia vile vile diagaliaga. Yeah. So na pato me panda chuma tu dogo but na panda ju almost seven floors ama eight floors. Yeah. That's so interesting. And before that, like what other spaces have you found yourself in? Ama this is what you studied in school na ukaingia hapo. Wacha ta tuseme Okay, nimefanya accounting eh? Okay. But sijai do kitote accounting. Me first of all nimeshona ngo za ladies. Sasa <laughs> kama wewe nikikucheki hivi afu nipatie machine. Ah. Nivo. Manzi. Wait, I can't see you sitting behind machine. <laughs> okay. Nili akufanya hivi ama dizile ah. digital. Zii ni ile machine electric eh? Okay. So una kwanza una M. Uh-huh. Unaeka kale kauzi kwa ile shindano. Yes. Piga hesabu kama uone. Na unje jidunga? Azi. How did you learn that? Wait, th- those are like you gay. So you're good with numbers. You're good with showing. Just tell us a little bit about that because that's a very interesting. Uh-huh. Uli lanaje yo? So actually, yo ni kwa na work place ya Mzai. Okay. At my dad's place. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, family business. Yeah, it's, it was a family business. Uh-huh. So una piga hesabu hata kama ni family business au uh, kopale based on commission. Wow. So pale hakuna team sati uni au ni mtoi wangu uh-huh. ni ya working on commission so bidi yako ndio do yako so you've done clothes and that's you know those are talents like those are skills yeah. really so that's yeah. amazing to know i right now you're in um, networking telecommunication kind of just making sure everyone is hearing everyone and seeing everyone yeah and then uh dj also ni yeah. surprise ni ningine umefanya we Vitu ni mo. For money. <laughs> hey, manze. Mimi nimetembeza juu tao bana. Oh no. <laughs> hey, for real. Yeah, nilikuwa... guy from you. You're so cute. I just be like I just want to buy from you cuz you're so cute. So actually nilikuwa nilikuwa nafanya job ya printing eh. Uh-huh. So pia nafanya printing and graphic design. So Nairobi. <laughs> <laughs> ah, can Nairo lazima job survive. <laughs> You know what? Yeah. Let's pause there. I need yeah. to go on a break. Yeah. But when we are back, you'll get to know more about Bullet. Please check out Bullet. What's your social media? It's yeah. right here on the screen, though. Actually, it's DJ Bullet. DJ Bullet are yeah. the ones and twos of the world. So, I can't even like when promo. Mm. This is DJ Bullet. Come on, pizza. You and I to make a jingle. We'll be right, right back. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. Release your creativity into the world around you and explore your mind without limits at the only place that lets you do so. The Vasha Creatives Hub is the home of sugar, spice, and everything nice for all creatives. With a lens, a mic, and a little help, it's lights, camera, action on the go. A soundproof facility for your podcast and the very first step to your own show with our state of the art setup. Studio hire services at prices so low, photo shoots for all your occasions, and our green screen package is so unreal there is no way you could say no. So, what are you waiting for? Head on down to the Vasha Creatives Hub on Thika Road, right next to KCA University and get all your artistic needs sorted out. For bookings, call 0724 500 574 today And we are back this is behind the helmet my name is Kerry Kakiri today's guest is DJ Bullet <laughs> Bullet I know he'll get back on the wheels of steel if you not been if you missed any part of this interview please go back to our YouTube channel the Vasha Creatives Hub get to catch up with all the amazing two wheelers that we've been hanging out with we're talking about his various careers and one of them we discovered was uh hey, Duo but kuna moja ajatuambia every biker ako na career ya ukulima aka Kab- shamba na maploti hey, na shamba na nayo yes let's talk about your best and your worst shamba i feel like there's a best shamba let me explain why mm-hmm. there's a shamba that teaches you a lesson yeah and a shamba that's just someone else's fault altogether yeah, true. so you can share about that so for me shamba ni menunua tatu only Eh, okay. number one il koko prime sema prime 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 so i told you nestal koko arif actually ni arif yes so tuko mua hills kwa zile twisties right ume ume mimi nimeingia hot uh-huh. nimelala banesta kwa mbele tu anachungulia kwa side mira kwa zile hapa kuna mtu anaanguka hapa oh, kuna mtu an... so mimi nilipata potholes tatu kubwa and gasheri alikuwa nyuma yangu gasheri hi yeah. All yeah. the way from wherever it is you are in the world. Kabisa. Gashiriel kwa nyuma yangu so nikacheki eh manzi. 
hapa nikiamua kupita hapa gasheria ta check hizo potholes oh. na ataweza jipata mengi ya place nyingine noma so i decided to go wide kwenda wide nikapatana na mchanga eh hey, manzi nilisikia nimesikia manzi hapo ndo pale nilikumbuka manzi hata ukidonda una foul lock please lock mkono kwa helmet do? like utakuwa two feet What did you do instead of locking? I I, 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 I I locked actually. Oh, I locked. Did. Well done. Okay. Uh, well done. Jo sikupata kitu major ati ninatoka naenda hosi. Right. No. And liko. I think falling well is prideful. You know descending off your bike. Yeah, true. Well. You know choosing how to die. Yeah, true. Yeah. Uh-huh. So mimi nilienda nilienda down afu ninaamka niko zile. Ah, hii ni shamba yangu ya kwanza was like. <laughs> so Ah, uh, nilikon me ride for long before kupata shamba. Okay. Actually nilikon me chapa miaka kadhaa before shamba. Right. Well done. So kupata hiyo ndo shamba ya kwanza kuna kale kale ka feeling. Right. Eh, ka ati, fear. Eh, Kadogo. Ah, kuna fear. Eh. Mimi siku siku waingizia. Oh wow. Yeah. And uh, kuna time tuliko ko ride after then we happened to lose one of us. Uh, it was a bad and a sad moment. You were in that ride. I was in that ride actually I was the sweeper. Oh man, I know that ride. Yeah. yeah. I know that ride. Yeah. Yeah. Any god. Yeah. I know that. Manze, ride. Uh, because most of us tulijipata tumeingia place noma. Yeah. Mimi mse wa Keja decided to hit the brakes, instant brakes na nilikoko nyuma. So I only had two options. Option number one. Niende right. Mm. Nipatane na bikers right. wale wameanguka. Right. Option number two, nijirushe the other side. Yes. But luckily enough nilijirusha hiyo side nyingine na nikaweza ku manage ku control the bike jo oh, wow. ilikuwa ko kuna ka off road kapate eh? afu then kuna ditch. Wow. Ditch just eh mazi. Wow. Yeah, pale karibu na soko mjinga. Yes. I yeah. I know I know that right. Yeah. If if you know you know. Yeah, There are sure. moments I think we'll eventually maybe we'll be able to talk about it as we go but it's still yeah. very very hard. Very fresh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Na ile yako yako ya kujitakia. And by the way so much to talk about in terms of group rides and stuff uh-huh. like that but we will continue about that but eh. Uh-huh. Okay, mimi sina shamba ya kujitakia. Okay. Tuanzie hapo. Zote has been caused by either protecting someone yeah. and most of you are for protecting someone. That's why I told you guys look at his heart guys. <laughs> He's putting himself at risk for other people like where where. Eh. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. So shamba yangu ya pili li happen ya outer. Yeah. Outer ring road. Eh. Hey. <laughs> Manze ni one lane and then mse wa bodame am watu just ku turn, ku take a U turn. Oh, so nilikuwa ni hit na katikati. Niko na Manze, niko na hapa. Uja maja gear, ana helmet, ana anything. So I just, I just decided kuangusha bike on the right hand side. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, that's bullet. That's all his shambas have just been for other people. Shamba um, moja prime bado inakaa. Shamba moja prime. Uh, <laughs> no, we hope not by the way. We just kill no. you have. Uh, no, okay. The last shamba ilikuwa kunaenda race uh-huh. ya Wesley Moran. So Oh, ugona ingine. These uh-huh. are four. Na the same. Three. Oh, that's three. Okay. Yo, sasa hiyo shamba ingine ni ya Outer bado. Yes. Mchiki kuna kale ka junction ka airport pale. Yes. Ako katano. Yes. That was the big round about yeah. then you go all the way. By the way, wh- wh- who came up with that road? <laughs> Just hi. Hi please. Wh- what was your thing? Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, so your time ni kona enda race. Race unafa ko mefika by 7 ndio ufanywe medical and scrutineering. Bike yangaliwe kama iko poa and everything. So Unataka home sanga pi wewe. Eh, we, mimi na time. <laughs> So mainly happened kutoka around 6:30. So ule mse ni kona goja tuli have ku pull na bike kabisa. Ndio tufike pale on time. Kupiga ile round down nikapata oil. Alafu sasa hizo nimelean knee down. Manze pale unasema ngatu yenyewe umekubali. So nilichapa chini but in it, uh, bike ilikuwa sawa. Nikaamka nikaenda uh, kwa truck. In fact bado nikaendelea kuvuta. You rest Yeah I did. But after the rest ndio nikakuwa zile na feel pain yes, inside. The impact. Yeah. So I had to toka kwa rega kumaliza hiyo kila kitu and then nikaingia kwa ambulance. You know when I meet 
If you does anyone have a comment, please comment below what you think about Bullet, please. Because the moment I meet a biker, I hmm. always extend so much grace to them. Because you don't know what this person has been through to get wherever it is they have. Bullet, I want to give you one minute to just give your parting shot. We can't get to know everything about it. So I'll encourage you all to go check out his page. He's so gracious because he posts the content. Uh, so DJ Bullet on our social media platforms, YouTube, um, Instagram. Yes. Zote, zote. Everywhere. Yeah. Please, Patena, your closing comment here. Just, you know, you have a platform right here. Nini you talk passionate about that you want our viewer to make sure that they know about us, two wheelers. Uh, number one, two wheelers, ni wasi. Let me say, Nini family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the way that two wheelers all shikana, they are great people. Mm -hmm. So anytime that you know another uh mtuote na kupita na bike, please share the road. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Usi seme ati, usi wanemu watu wa boda. In fact, we are not watu wa bodas. Yeah. We are not. Yeah, true. And, and Bullet, I want to encourage you to do something. This has been an initiative that we've been thinking about as Private Bikers Association, which is to adopt the nearest Boda Boda stage near you. Yeah. Kumenta wase, because I'm sure they look up to you, wana kugotea, wana like. So you can be able to have conversations with them, mentor yeah. them, guide them on yeah. how to do safe things. So that mtu mungina sipatane na mtu wa yuta antena katikati ya bara bara. Actually have a group ya wase wa Boda up mtani. Man, this guy is gold, rock solid. Right. It's so nice to meet you. This has been Behind the Helmet. We only have very few minutes to do everything we need to do. So thank you so much right. for watching. If you want to see more of this, please like, share, and subscribe, comment, share this video so that we know you're loving it. I'm at Wacha Kunzifanya all together. Now I see how Kuchapa like. Right. Thank you so much, Mola. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Now just say makamu kwa single, but atuto uliza yo swani. Bye, guys. Kuna ile ngoma ni kwa single. Apanda, nisha, ikata wangu. Pata wangu. Mba yo sasa, nisha mpata. Right. So cute. Watakuna mekwa giruka, watu kwa isho. Watu mekwa giruka na. So na kamu kwa isho wa doakta kwa single. Ah, kwa single. Na kumbe. Hi, guys. Thanks for watching. Right. Right. My name is Bullet from TRNK, Republic of TRNK. Anyways, for today, I'm going to be demonstrating a 360 turn uh, in a tight space, that is a small space. Mostly what I'm going to be doing, I'll be going round. Again, what I'm, I won't be doing is, I won't be applying brakes, I won't be clutching in. Reason, if you clutch in, you'll end up falling. And if you brake too hard, you'll end up falling.